Hey guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your daily general message for Tuesday, uh, August 20th, 2024. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in your own private reading, all that information as well as the Amazon links to my books are down below in the description box below. So let's get started here. We're going to do August 20th, 2024. Someone's going to have a good day. I literally felt that. Patience pays off is what this tells me. Let me go write that down for your title. Don't let me forget. Uh, patience with the temperance here, Sagittarius energy, it pays off. Okay, Because of you being uh, patient here, there's going to be communication, work being put in, a decision by them to come on in. Okay, After a very tough cycle, you refuse to deal with this nonsense anymore. With that hand of the of the uh, devil, so a little bit of mental anguish here of not dealing with the I can't say those words, uh, but yeah, some beep going on here, okay, uh, but not going through it anymore with that hand face and the wheel of fortune here, uh, and a lot of mental anguish here as well. I feel and the frustration it's all going to balance out. So basically, this tells me. Uh, that after all the frustration, the mental anguish, the calming yourself down kind of and healing your energy here, you don't have to deal with this anymore because I feel that your patience now is paying off, literally. That Three of Pentacles is, yes, known for putting in the work here, but that's showing the action. Pentacles is actually money, okay? Uh, but it's balance as well. But I feel that all that hard work in yourself and pay and being patient here, it's time for them to come on in. For some, I feel that you feel that you could be, uh, you know, picking up on their energy. You're using your intuition. You're manifesting for the return here. You know that they are coming back. You can feel it, that gut feeling. That's your intuition here. Uh, you could be dealing with a water sign. You yourself could be water sign here with that Queen of Cups. You got Sagittarius. You got Taurus here. Uh, you got them all. You got fire sign. Like I always say, I don't really go by the sign per se. I go by the energy of the card here. But that's what I'm feeling. Let's do the above and below on like Monday. Uh, temperance and the Wheel of Fortune. Long tough cycle. You're moving forward now with that Six of Swords in this relationship with the uh, Hierophant. Okay, that stands for a relationship, a commitment here. There's now work being put into this again after a lot of mental anguish. But I'm also feeling that you yourself put in a lot of work on yourself here with that Three of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords. With the Two of Wands and the... And the, yeah, I hear you. Uh, the two of wands and the seven of wands. They wanted me to add. There's that hesitation. Dev hates adding. <laughs> uh, that is the nine of wands. So they are eager to go, go, go to fix the situation. They're coming in, you know, not overly aggressive, which is good. Checking in on you. How's your life? Are you dating any? But we, I have a friend that... <laughs> I have a friend story time. I have a friend of mine that uh, every time we don't talk a lot, but we're good friends. You know, we've known each other for like about 12 years now. And every time that I communicate, every time he communicates, whoever our first question is, say dating anyone. <laughs> we always, and we always laugh because neither of us are, you know, but yeah. So, but we're just friends, you know, but <laughs> Yeah, but it's always funny. So I feel like somebody out there is going to get this question of, are you dating anyone? You know, kind of thing. Ch checking the check in the background, checking the scenery here, making sure that everything's in the clear. I really feel that strongly. Like they're going to try to find out if you're seeing somebody. Okay. Uh, but yeah, so and with that outcome card, and that was the Knight of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles, sorry. So they're going to fix things. They're going to bring total completion of balance here with that Ten of Pentacles. You're going to intuitively feel it, I feel, for some out there, but that love is going to help draw them in, too, knowing that they are returning here after a long journey here, for sure. Uh, and they they could be apologizing, absolutely. They want that happiness with you again, 
with the Queen of Cups, the Page of Cups, and the Three of Cups. Lots of water energy right there. That is what I have, guys. Thank you all for watching. I truly do appreciate it. Love you guys. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also, smash that like button, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.